Union Test Prep's Math Practice Test for the Para Pro Assessment. If you're taking the Para Pro Assessment, you'll need to do well on the math section. See how you do on this five question Para Pro math test with a pause screen to give you time to solve. Let's dive in. Question 1. Which of the following fractions is equivalent to 3 quarters? A. 2 thirds. B. 4 sixths. C. 6 eighths. D. 8 tenths. To determine the equivalent fraction, we need to find a fraction with the same value as 3 fourths. To do this, we can either multiply or divide the numerator and denominator by the same number. If we multiply both the numerator and denominator by 2 we get 6 eighths. Therefore, the correct answer is C, 6 eighths. Question 2. What is the value of x in the equation 4x plus 8 is equal to 20? A. 5 B. 4 C. 2 D. 3 To solve this equation, we need to isolate the variable x. Subtracting 8 from both sides of the equation gives us 4x equals 12. Now, to find the value of x, we divide both sides by 4, which gives us x equals 3. Therefore, the correct answer is d, 3. Question 3. Simplify 3, 2 plus 5, minus 4, 3 minus 1. A, 19. B, 14. C, 13. D, 20. To simplify the expression, apply the order of operations. Parentheses. Exponents. Multiplication and division. Addition and subtraction. Each from left to right. First, we simplify inside the parentheses. 3, 2 plus 5, minus 4. 3 minus 1 is 3 times 7 minus 4 times 2. Next, we multiply. 3 times 7 minus 4 times 2 becomes 21 minus 8. Finally, we subtract. 21 minus 8 equals 13. Therefore, the correct answer is C, 13. Question 4. If a sale price is $75 and the original price was $100, what is the percent of discount? A. 10% B. 20% C. 25% D. 30% To find the percent of discount we need to calculate the difference between the original price and the sale price. And then divide it by the original price. The difference between the original price, $100, and the sale price, $75, is $25. Dividing $25 by $100. And then multiplying by 100 gives us 25%. Therefore, the correct answer is C, 25%. Question 5. A rectangle has a length of 15 cm and a width of 10 cm. What is the area of the rectangle? A. 25 square centimeters. B. 150 square centimeters. C. 50 square centimeters. D. 100 square centimeters. The area of a rectangle is found by multiplying the length by the width. Multiplying the length, 15 centimeters, by the width, 10 centimeters, 
gives us an area of 150 square centimeters. Therefore, the correct answer is B, 150 square centimeters. For more free practice tests for the ParaPro assessment, check out uniontestprep.com.